feedback, feedback. that other people did about my project, about uh, this portfolio page. I asked for the feedback on Reddit critique. I also posted my project in FreeCodeCamp forum. It's not easy to give and get the feedback on designs because it's very subjective. However, it's really uh, worth doing, worth getting. It makes you better, not just only as the designer, but also as the developer because you have to finally implement all of the new solutions. I will look for some inspiration uh, on Pinterest, Dribble, and in Freecode Camp Forum, how others did their portfolio. Maybe something, uh, maybe there will be something that uh, will really inspire me to redesign my portfolio. I'm not sure uh, what should I change exactly uh, because. Uh, the comments uh, are like, you know, it's uh, too big, too small uh, about the same thing. It's too bright, too dark, so it's always very subjective. You have to be careful with that. co-campers just uh, surprised me with the answer because uh, the person wrote that it's it's a pleasure to work and to learn to learn sorry it's a pleasure to learn from experienced people like you and if he knew how beginning level I am maybe he wouldn't write so and he continues as we beginners as we beginners so I'm not I'm rather too um, can go so deeply into the code. Thank you. So it was the response for uh, for my project review. So I did uh, the code review of the project and tried to help a bit. We beginners very often um, underestimate ourselves. I got the same problem. You know, practice makes perfect and also practice helps you to get rid of this imposter syndrome and whatever it's called. So everybody's starting some from somewhere and the thing is to keep on doing, keep on learning and getting better. Developers who have years of practice but stay in the same language and they do not develop, they are also beginners in other stuff. They know more, uh, they can connect the dots and learn the new frameworks and languages faster, but still they are beginners. So everybody is a beginner. And the awesome thing about code society is that we share the knowledge, we help each other, and that's great. So keep on learning, practice, and we will be all experiencing something. As a result, we can share our knowledge, help ourselves, and develop as a community. Keep on doing.
Wednesday. Yesterday I've been revising all of the projects for front-end certificate from Free Code Camp. I've been changing a bit the colors in some projects, correcting accessibility, or changing a bit the layout. Majority of the changes uh, were the results of the feedback that I got. Sure, in the beginning you think, okay, they are not right, I did a lot of work. You know, everybody who is a creator uh, loves the work more than the audience. The problem is that we don't see many things that other people see because they see the project for the first time. Whatever it is concerning the application, it's worth asking. The more you ask, the better you know, the better your app can look. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. You'll never have the sacred stone. <laughs> oh, this you crazy mother. five months ago. The more you know, the more you know that you don't know. I also know how much is in front of me and I'm more and more aware of that, which is great, which is great because uh, you don't learn if you don't uh, set yourself for uh, the challenges. story that I want to tell, starting from who I am, going through what I do, later how I do it, showing how I do it, and finishing on the option to contact me. Friday. I'm reading the documentation for the new project. It's Friday in the afternoon and soon I will be finishing this week of work and I still haven't reached 500 points, I mean the brownie points from Freecode Camp, but I don't worry about that because still I helped a lot of people and I promise to reach these points uh, before starting React challenges. Today I haven't done much uh, on learning new stuff. I was analyzing the uh, documentation for the project I wanna get but it was also kind of lesson to analyze the documentation once again, uh, write the questions to our clients, so it's also a lesson. The week is almost finished. This week I've been mostly iterating over the projects I've done before, and I've been giving and receiving feedback. The problems that I met, 
this week was not enough time for unexpected things happening. And the next week will be quite busy because we have Feria de Malaga in uh, Malaga here. So the whole city will be having party. And uh, I also have guests from Poland with kids. So I think that I have to plan it wisely. Next week, I'm going to learn SAS and Flexbox. I'm going to sum up my way to front end certificate on Medium. I will keep on giving feedback and browning. Keep on doing, see you next week.